All right, this video is how to edit your reading list on your Mac desktop in your Safari browser. So anyway, your reading list shows up in two different spots on this new uh, software. If you look and you open up to your start page, which is right here, you can see it says start page right there. It's a new start page or your landing page. They call it start page. And you look, you get favorites, you get frequently visit, you got privacy report, but right here you have your reading list. Now, if you go over here and click on this, what we can do is we can eliminate everything but our reading list so that we can just look at that for right now. Now, the other way you can look at your reading list is up here. So if I click on this, you're going to see your reading list here. If you notice, use widgets for iPhone, use widgets. Delray Beach Surf Report, Delray Beach Surf Report. Now you can go over here and you can show more. And it can go right down the line. If you notice what's here, you know, if you go here, you're going to see it right here, all the way, just as it is here. Now, if you want to keep something or mark it as red, you can click it here. But if you want to delete it, you click here. So the way you do that is by moving your finger either to from right to left, which I just disappeared that one. I'm going to put my cursor over this. Now I'm going to move from the right to the left, and it's going to pull this. If I keep going, it just removes it, and it's gone. And um, let's do the, see if there's anything else that I don't really care about. Let's get rid of this one. Now, the other way you can do it is you can move it over and then just click on it. Or you can just slide it all the way over and it just disappears. And that changes over here, as you saw. Now, you can show less or you can show more. It's up to you. And that's how you edit your reading list. If you want to collapse your reading list, you click up here. If you want to open it up so you can look at it, it's here. But it's also here. So you have a choice. If you don't want it here, you can come down and just get rid of it. And now, this is your landing page. If you want to look at your reading list, you'd have to go in here. So that's how you edit your reading list uh, in Safari. I'm going to go back here. I'm just going to put everything back in by clicking these boxes. I'm all back in there. And if I want to collapse this again, I can make it smaller. Same thing with this one up here. All right, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos on how to use your Apple products. Peace out.